Well, here we are guys again for a long range distance test. A lot of you guys have been asking for this long range test because I'm the only guy that's got this board at the moment. So it's the Vestar board Night Fury and we're gonna be checking out uh, a range around here, Olympic Park. I'm sorry I came here again, but I've got to do a, probably a 40 kilometer ride on this today because it's a kick-ass 14 amp hour battery, which is massive. So this is a place where it's reasonably flat, no people, I can just get out there and do it, get the drone up. So today we're gonna to test out the Festar board's latest edition, that is the Night Fury Boosted Stealth Killer. Super thin, love this board. Awesome 1500 watt belt drive motors and we've got a kick-ass 14 amp hour battery. I'm predicting, they're saying a 40 kilometer range, I think at my weight, 94 kilos. I'm carrying the tripod, the drone, I'm carrying five kilos. I'm around about 98 kilo weight on today's ride. So I'll see how it goes on that and uh, let's get out into it and do the long range distance test on the Vesta board, Night Fury. Uh, I've got my uh, tripod camera uh, and my drone at the bottom. So, so let's get out and do this ride. It's gonna be a hell of a long ride, probably four hours marathon. Let's get into it. Wow, this is such a flexi deck. I've forgotten how flexy it is. It's amazing. Well, we just started. We've got a long way to go. Okay, straight off the bat, this thing has got a lot of power, but um, it's a refined power. Really smooth. Here's some sort of tram track things here. Didn't even feel them. Okay, so it's got a lot of uh, a lot of smoothness. It's really bouncy deck. It's a really smooth ride. I'm going medium speed about 30 k's an hour. Um, it's a really smooth ride, really bouncy, bouncy. It's exactly like the Stealth Boosted. And I've ridden the Boosted Stealth, it's exactly the same feel. Uh, probably even smoother uh, in, in a sense. No belt noise at all. We'll check in a bit later. <laughs> Checking in on the Vestar Night Fury. Let's have a look at the uh, Apple Watch. 49, oh, sorry, 50 minutes, uh, 7.3 kilometers, and uh, the average speed's about 12 k because I was going across the bridge and I stopped for a while, so uh, I can't stop with the pause button because it stuffs up the mileage. But if I leave it uh, not paused, unpaused, whatever, uh, it then does a a wrong calibration for the average speed but that's not important today it's about the length how far we go uh, and overall uh, range so uh, there we go uh, 50 minutes uh, 7.3 kilometers and the battery is on three and one bar flashing there we go three one bar flashing so I think we'll call that uh, four bars three bars two bars and one bar right and we've got three and a half bars so we've lost half uh, a first bar and we've done seven kilometers so it's pretty good so let's push on these belts are so forgiving right this has got to be one of the most smoothest skateboards and absolutely nicest ride i've ever been on it's just super smooth um, i don't know what it is about it but it's, it's the deck maybe it's the motors it's just super smooth like it's even small it's more smooth and more refined feeling than a boosted stealth just is absolutely beautiful the bounce on the deck uh, yeah it's just amazing we've got some uh, train tracks ahead here go across those uh, cross 
there you go. Didn't even feel a thing. Um, yeah, pretty heavy train track, so yeah, it's just, just a beautiful ride. Loving this board. Really nice. Okay guys, checking in, uh, it's now 13 kilometers um, and the time is uh, so far uh, 1 hour 22 minutes, I stopped to do some drone stuff and average speed's about 17 kilometers an hour and the battery is now down to, as you can see, 3, 75%. Let's get going, we've got a lot more riding to and I'm running out of light. some sprinkler systems going right across the track no way I'm going through that what the hell is it some marijuana plantation middle of nowhere hilarious no I'm not going that way I'll keep pushing on okay dudes at the halfway point here I want to tell you uh, to listen to the motors on this ready take off the standing start there's no screaming belts nice takeoff the more I ride this thing, it's getting smoother and smoother and quieter and quieter. Uh, listen to this. You hear that? This has got to be the most smoothest refined electric skateboard I've ever ridden. It's actually smoother and quieter than a stealth, to be honest. And I'm not knocking boosted. Boosted stealths are an amazing technology. It's like another level, okay? You can't possibly fault that board. It's just absolutely unbelievable technology. But for $2,500 opposed to this thing, which is, it deflects your deck on it. It's just bouncing along. If you're thinking of getting a boosted stealth, get one of these. I guarantee you, I can recommend it. It is really an awesome feeling board. This is medium speed. Look, I'm going to do it now about 38 kilometers now on medium. Unbelievable ride. I feel like I'm riding a $2,000, $3,000 electric skateboard. It is absolutely refined. So smooth and so quiet. This deck, I'm just loving it. It's so bouncy. Let's check in now and see what we're up to. Okay, let's have a look. Right. Okay, one hour, 50 minutes. 21 kilometers. And the battery is... Okay, it's two. It's two, not not two. No, it's two and a half actually. So I'll just, just show that again. Two and a half. So we're well and truly halfway through, uh, but um, I think we'll get 40 kilometers. I think we will. We'll keep going. Okay, so we've, I've just run into a guy, Steve, is it? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Steve, yeah. Now check what Steve's got. Now, look, what are you riding? Let, let's have a look at it. Oh my god. Yeah, well, actually just got, got this online, so... Uh, You're kidding. Years ago ...and actually just kind of like kept on modifying it, so it does about 
somewhere up to about when you're actually pushing out probably about 45 50 k's an hour so. you're kidding 50 k's and what about so because so. it's all yeah you know when it's illegal so yeah, yeah. these things are probably <laughs> legal as well the same, so, exactly yeah, exactly <laughs> they have police so, yeah. so what's the mileage on that battery and what sort of size battery this is one it? here because it's a new one i haven't actually tested it yet yeah um, but i actually ride from olympic park to Parramatta and back every day and it's still got heaps of probably like, no. twice as much on are you it, so. serious yeah yeah just yeah, check no, this out guys really look at this bike this is like electric bike mountain bike isn't it kind of thing wow oh my gosh that's so yeah, nice great fun. So, and uh geez so you bought it online well, you? this one here i actually bought for about 1100 bucks um what? it's been modified since so yeah 1100 so just have to look out on ebay or alibaba or somewhere for the you know the right deal so. my god alibaba or ebay yeah yeah. So let's have a look. Is that the name of the actual bike or no? Uh, that was the actual name of it. Yeah, I don't think you can actually get them. So okay, I love the battery. It doesn't matter. Lock, it doesn't lock matter. The so, yeah, yeah, that's been, you know, that's a new one. So yeah. Um, that's awesome. Yeah. I'll, I'll tell you, Steve, it's, uh, this is the go is electric, electric, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it certainly is. So yeah, yeah. So there you go. I'm riding out here doing my job. This this guy, Steve, comes along. He's just coming from work, cruising around on his ball. On his bike. Unbelievable. There you go, guys. So it's all electric for the future, hey? Exactly. exactly. Oh, Weekend's bored, so. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Steve, thank you so much. That's awesome. Thank you. Look at that. My yeah. guys, we're checking in two hours, 40 minutes, 27 kilometers, and the remote is now showing two bars. There you go. So it's effectively 50% used, and we're 27 kilometers. This is crazy. I'll keep going. Okay guys, 27 kilometers in, just check this out. Listen to the noise of these motors. Well, there's no noise really, just dead quiet. Crazy. Just beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Let's go. Just took that hill there, just to give you an idea, I'm still taking hills on this thing. And it's still got plenty of bite. Um, Amazing. Chapeau, à 
to show you from a standing start with 1.5 battery. Watch. And this is the Hobby Wing. Beautiful, smooth takeoff. No jerk. Heaps of power. Now I'm still in medium mode. Uh, I'm liking it. I've got heaps of power. 36 kilometers per hour, maybe 38. Heaps of bite at 1.5 bars. Now, let me say, look at this view. It's just friggin' amazing. I love this time of night. Well, this time of day is my witching hour because I don't get out of bed for less than $10,000 a day at 6 a.m. in the morning. So I get up around about 10, I do these runs till dark. So I've got the shred lights fully charged. So I'll be dry, probably riding right through till dark. Um, so I've still got about 10 k's to go on this battery. Now I want to say something about these trucks. My God, look at this. I mean, Jesus, I'll try and get a high view of this. Watch. These trucks friggin' carve like crazy. Forget Paris trucks and bloody Shredder. I've ridden them all. This is one of the nicest carving trucks I have ever, ever felt in my life. Um, there's something about this board, the combination, the thin deck, the fiberglass, the flex. It's just beautiful to carve. It's like surfing. The closest thing it is is to my uh, Goldwing Sidewinder double um, bushing trucks. That's the only ones that come close to this. Um, sorry, that's the only ones that these come close to my Goldwing. This is just insane. Carving is just amazing. God, it feels good. It's like centrifugal G-force holding you in. Okay, guys, I've just had um, one beep. Uh, sorry, one vibrate only. With it, that was reaching from two bars down to 1.5, and then I rode 1.5 for about four kilometres. It then had two vibrations, and that let me know I'm below 1.5. Another two vibrations, and that brought me down to one. So there you have um, one bar. Oh, it's still 1.5. Okay, 1.5. Okay, so a bit of la a little bit of lag there, not much. So what have I done? Three hours, 27 minutes, uh, and 37 kilometres. This is crazy. So it's going to get 40, easy. Um, I'm sitting on about 24 kilometres an hour now, 24. So if you if you, if you need to limp home and you need to get home on the one bar or 1.5, you'll know you can get about six kilometres probably. I think we'll break 40. This is a record for the uh, channel. First time ever. So there you go. Let's keep riding. There she goes. Look at that. Still got heaps of bite. Wow. I've smashed it today. Hasn't missed a beat. Not made one sound. Still whisper quiet and smooth. Incredible. I just stopped it now because um, I've actually got one bar, right? I'll just show you, right? One bar completely, there you go, and it's vibrating twice, okay? So it's vibrating twice every five minutes and you've got one bar. So it's letting you know you've got one bar, okay? Now, let's just see, yeah, just make a few other little, little buzzes there. Let's just see now what one bar, how many Ks you can get. So what is it? Three hours, 36 minutes, 38 kilometers. So let's see if we can get to 40, it'll be a record. So we know now, um, if you guys want to limp home at one bar, solid one bar, we'll see what it can do. Let's go. Okay guys, we're now one bar solid. I'll just show you that so you can see it. Now I'm gonna show you a hill here just behind. Um, it's a little hill, but the idea is just to show you it's still got torque and power at one bar, and this is a pretty steep hill, it'll be about 18%. So let's go have a look, okay? I'll just show you. Okay, there we go. Let's have a look. So standing start, pretty much. Yeah, still pipe, still plenty of bite, plenty of torque. Took that hill really quickly, really easily. So it didn't really lose any kind of torque.
Okay, checking in. Um, we're looking <laughs> three hours, 54 minutes at this point in time. Uh, and we've still got uh, one bar on there, solid, not flashing. And you ready for this? 43 kilometers. <laughs> You'll see it all on Map My Ride. This is no bullshit. This is the real deal. This thing has got no sag. You saw that hill it just took then. Let's try this hill here, which is usually where these boards die when I got 10% left like now let's check it out let's see what it can do so i'll put you on a wider stick on that so you can see a bit more okay let's have a look okay righto so i get a bit of a bit of a turn here okay is it biting yeah full bite full bite look at that and i'll just show the hill It's a decent hill, you know, it's a hill. It's still got bite. This is crazy. This is the best result ever I've had on any battery. Um, yeah, this is astounding. So, uh, so far, no sag, uh, minimal loss of torque and bite, virtually 5% loss, uh, still heaps of speed, uh, and we're looking at uh, approaching 45 kilometers. I'll come back when I'm just about dead. Okay guys, checking in now. I'm now down to one bar flashing, finally. I'll just get the remote. There we go. Uh, you can see now one bar is flashing uh, and it's four hours and one, <laughs> finally laughing saying it. Four hours and one minutes of riding. Um, yeah, I'm pretty stuffed. And you ready for this? 44.6 kilometers so far. We've still got, I'm gonna go around my car now on the flat just to see if it's still got bite and um, which it has and then uh, yeah basically we'll run it right dry so yeah 44.6 kilometers on this 14 amp hour battery insane okay come back okay we're just about uh, one bar flashing and uh, it's still got a bit of bite but there's no more you know direct bite um, I think that's that's my car just there and I'm going to come back to that because I'm not going to go too far. This looks like it. Uh, yeah, I'm pushing it now. I've got a little bit of bite, but not much. I've got the actual shred lights on and tail lights now because it's nearly getting dark. Uh, I think that'll be it. I'll pull up here and I'll just see if it takes this hill. Yeah, it's still gonna take this hill. Can you believe that? One bar flashing. So you will get, um, I'm traveling about probably um, something like 20 kilometers an hour. It's still got power up this hill. But I think it's gonna die very much now. I think we're just about there. Okay, we're down to one bar flashing. And there's a little bit of bite, but that's about it. Uh, yeah. I kind of, will I get to my car? I'm pretty sure I will. Okay, that, yeah, there's still a little bit of bite. You probably get about 200 meters. That's, that's it. Let's pull over and have a quick chat and I'll show you what it is. Okay, shred lights are on now because I've been driving so long. And okay, uh, guys, that was pretty epic. Here she is. Here she is. Uh, shred lights on. Uh, okay, you want to hear what it is? This is it. Four hours and 14 minutes on this thing standing. Um, 46.92 kilometers unbelievable let's call that 92 let's just call that 47 kilometer range average speed was about 23 kilometers per hour um, and uh, the battery is one bar flashing so one bar flashing is technically dead just quick points of note on this when you got one bar left um, 
you can get from 38 kilometers to 47. So you're talking five, six, seven kilometers. I'm weighing 95 kilos. Most of the ride I had five kilo backpack on, so I've got 100 kilo weight. That is damn impressive for that board, and that is a damn good battery. I can tell you right now, the rating for this will be 9.9. .9. You can't make this shit up. You can't even, you can't joke about this. This is just the real world, uh, you know, test and the real world uh, scenario. So um, there you go. Till next time, guys. Happy skating, safe skating. I'll see you in the next vlog. Andrew Penman signing off. Je